Hello all traders, welcome to SusanFX1 channel. In this uh, video, I want to talk about some of my trades on GBP and I want to give analysis on uh, GP trades today. Uh, today is uh, 5th of uh, November, Tuesday, 2019. We can see that uh, there is many news has been before and um, uh, there is uh, some miners uh, FOMC uh, release about 23 minutes. And there comes some uh, nice um, more important news about one hour on USD and CAD and again USD later. Let's have a look at the charts. Um, this chart is um, Euro British Pound and I am buying right now this pair and um, there, there is a reason for this um, that I'm buying right now it's because um, when we look at this um, pair that this uh, pair has been uh, bearish all the way to this area and has been in the range since my expectation for this pair is that um, this pair should one day I don't know when break to the upside this is my expectation and my uh, prediction for this uh, pair and when I uh, look at this pair in uh, lower time frames like 15, I can see that the price from this uh, area come all the way down to this zone and get rejected. The reason that I uh, began to buy in this uh, area is because of this um, weekly support. It's been shown here by this indicator here I have. Later on, I will tell you where you can find it and put it in your uh, chart if you want to. This uh, indicator show you automatically the weekly support, the weekly resistance, daily support, and H4 support and resistance on the chart, very clean and nicely. This area and uh, price hit this area and get rejected. So my uh, intention is that uh, GBP sooner or later gets weak and dive down and CHF will rise, Euro will rise, something sh that I uh, predict that it will happen in the um, um, before the US session and during the US session um, uh, many things will happen. Uh, I have uh, noticed that whenever uh, in the beginning of the US session or right before the US session when there are news release uh, for US or CAD or whatever it will change totally the sentiment uh, of the market okay so um, let's have a look at this place right here this is a weekly support a weekly support is a very very important indication for the price either this price will carry on or gets rejected and we can clearly see that price has been rejected couldn't stay under this weekly support okay Let's have a look at GPCHF. I am selling this and right now I'm heavily in the profit as I were speaking here, this big candle come true. Okay, um, I just uh, closed uh, some of the uh, positions here in this trade and um, I was good enough. You shouldn't be greedy get what markets give you and uh, run in this trade i will hold uh, with two positions i want to keep them because i think most likely that this uh, price will uh, go higher but this one i close it all uh, as you saw uh, 78 pips in a matter of time 78 pips just happened uh, and um, as you can see here um, the pullback is very uh, powerful it can stop and go lower but um, I didn't want to risk it and uh, that's why I closed them. Let me tell you why I sold here. When I uh, look at the chart uh, of a GPCHF in a four hour time frame, I can see that um, the same scenario, opposite side of the Euro JPY, price rise to the strong uh, daily support here and it hold it all the way. My prediction is that this price go this way and um, it's just the banks that uh, are gathering positions here and um, this must fall 
to this direction before it goes this way okay this is how it is so um let's have a look at gpcat uh gpcat in uh, four hour when we look at it it's um bearish and uh, because of uh, this uh, news that is coming here uh, something should happen to this price my prediction is that um, GBP go lower today this is my uh, prediction for uh, GBP can be true can be false but this is what I think because of uh, all these strong barriers resistance price couldn't go through get back down couldn't go through get back down again and now price is stopping right here at h4 support and struggling if this support get broke i am in but not right now let's have a look at it let's have a look at gbp usd gp usd in four hour look like this we had a very strong run from this level to this level and um, many many people bought the GBP to these levels and price had a pullback to this area gone its right way because as you can see price is bullish so we expect that this price goes up but what about these sections it happened here happened also here but this one can go lower as long as this price holding itself above this area can come here come here come here from here go all the way up but as long as this price holding itself above this zone we clear this we have a very strong zone here as long as this price is above this zone we are in the bullish trend but this arrow here in four hour gives me an indication that we are bearish in four hour my expectation is that this move go lower than this level here okay this is my expectation but overall i think gp is bearish this week don't expect any miracles yet for gbp to go up not not yet as you can see here things are progressing for the um, euro gbp and um trading is a slow process very slow process it takes about 10 seconds for you to uh, put a position for buy or sell but uh to keep the trade running is also a kind of some kind of duty for you you have to practice to hold the trades uh, and you have to uh, have a knowledge when to close them when to keep them running and all that but right now i keep this um, trade uh, because i believe that this uh, price going higher lastly i will tell you where you can find this indicator if you want to it's right here i will put the link of this uh, site uh, the name is uh, support and resistance mtf indicator gives you the uh, weekly four hour daily uh, support and resistance on your chart which can be very beneficiary for you uh, to use okay and if you want to use it just have to um, click once here and then you get it as a zip file you just have to unzip it by a for example WinRAR program and then you have to put the indicator on your mt4 indicator folder i hope you enjoyed this uh, analysis on gbp and you like uh, what i do for you and um, if you have any question just write it down uh, and um, if you are not subscribed to my channel, subscribe please, hit the like button, nice day, bye.